Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel Gemini. I hope you are doing well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Gemini sign, please. Let us see what is the guided message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know. This is for your sign. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Thank you guys for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, Gemini, please click the bell. Click subscribe. Let us see what is coming towards you, Gemini. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know? And ready for you to know this is for your sign, okay? Think about your situation. Think about your focus. Think about your person. I'll connect with you and... I'll tap into your energy and let's see what you got, okay? Whew. What can I get for the Gemini sign? You have a Queen of Pentacles in here. You have the Page of Wands, the Four of Swords. What is coming towards you is a Two of Wands. Center of the reading is the Judgment card. It's about time, okay? There's an Eight of Pentacles in here. The connecting energy between you and the situation is an Ace of Wands. You have the Knight of Swords. You've got the Four of Cups. And so we start your reading. In terms of your current energies, your focus, your situation, the Queen of Pentacles in here, it looks like you might want to I'm hearing the word Gemini that you need to make a smart decision connected to money. Okay. The Queen of Pentacles in here, the Page of Cups. Um, you're being encouraged, Gemini, to take a good look at where you're spending your time, your money, your energy. Um, like make an informed decision, like smart decision when it comes to your money, your savings, where you spend the most of your energy. And because the page of wands is next to the queen of pentacles in here. So somehow you're being discouraged to be impulsive and you're being encouraged to make a smart decision because the Four of Swords in here, it's sitting in your challenge energy, which makes me feel that if you want to have a complete piece of, like, if you want to have a complete peace of mind and to safeguard your future, to safeguard something or protect your money, protect your energy, pr protect your own interests, you know, um, you've got to really spend a lot of time thinking versus impulsiveness because page of wants like this is a spark oh i want to buy this oh i want to do this so there's something about avoid quick thinking when it comes to like try to avoid impulsive thinking or if you can spend more time into making a smart decision in money and resources even the way you communicate in here in the page of cups because I'm kind of picking up the vibe that, you know, for things to, you know, like, it's so easy for you to say, look, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Like, maybe you don't meant to say sorry, you know, like for things to just to end, um, you're going to say sorry or there's something that you do say, like there's a, there's, there's something in here that, um, there's something in here connected to communication, to money, spending money, spending time, spending in energy in here that try try to avoid saying those or try to really spend enough time and make a smart, informed decision about, you know, maybe it could be a daily thing in here, but it's becoming a habit of yours, okay? And because it's been your habit, um, you tend to go to sleep and there's a part of you that you regret it and it carries on with your sleep and the next day somehow that energy still build up so smart decision okay smart decision like try to make 
things slow, uh, slowly react and smart decision, okay? In here. Yeah, look at that. This is impulsive. The Knight of Wands, he's very smart, but he is impulsive, okay? You're very smart. You're very on point. Just try to put things, try to put more time into perspective and logical before jumping into something. Because I could feel like you could save more money. You could save more time. You could get better result, you know, result in here, Gemini, okay? All right, so that is your energy checked in in here. Um, also, I don't know, guys, maybe just to end the quarrel with somebody, you would say, look, I'm sorry. You know, like we we, we, we use the word, we, we use certain words that's just to keep, like maybe to dismiss, look, I'm sorry, let's end this. Like, let's end the quarrel, I'm sorry. Or you could have this habit of, you, it's possible that you have this kind of habit where just to make sure that you don't disconnect with them, you will be the one to say sorry, okay? So try not to do that, okay? Be kind to yourself. Be kind Be be, be kind to yourself, you know? Those are, those are, you know, those are things that it's best to mend it. Or maybe I'm also getting, because Four of Swords in here, you are not. You are not you are you are not at fault, you know. You are not at fault, and yet you say sorry because you want to keep the person, or there's something that you you say it, and it's not coming from the heart, and it's just to keep it to keep them. You would rather just say sorry, you know. But if you do, like diplomatically argue your point, you actually have a valid point. Like someone is acting. Oh, Gemini is going to say sorry, you know. So try to really have a smart decision, smart communication. Spend time in reacting, in communicating, and also smart decision with your resources, with your energy in here, okay? Look into that, okay? All right. Now, the second part of the reading, Gemini. Let's see what is coming towards you, who is coming towards you, what's connected to you, Okay. Now, you could be dealing with an Aries, a Leo, Sagittarius energy. The Judgment card, this could be a Sagittarius, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. This could be connected to work, money, finances. It could also be someone... It could be a situation or a person that you connect with them on a daily basis, like you regularly connect with this person on a daily basis. It's also connected to the place you visit, okay? Like you have a daily, regular um, connection with this person or situation. Because the judgment card, this is like an all out. What is coming towards you is, and if you look at the two of wands, this is two and the ace of wands. You're connecting energies, the ace of wands towards the two of wands. So this is something that will excite you. It's coming from work. It's coming from overseas. It's also coming from a person who you've been looking forward to this, Gemini. Okay. Um, you've been looking forward to this news or I would say this is a major update given that this is the judgment card. This is a major update. This is... This is... A pretty good looking news I would say uh, with the eight of pentacles it could be money news but they won't come back if they don't have like a good news okay because the two of wands it's def it's 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 close okay like I'm really picking up the vibe that this two of wands it's getting closer so it could happen tomorrow and there's a knight of swords in here it could be Gemini Libra Aquarius in here I see you responding replying to them Okay, like the the minute you got the email, the news, the call, or as soon as you hear about this announcement or news, maybe vacancy, you're acting fast and excited. Okay, two of wands. Ooh, you will get the offer, Gemini. You will get something good out of this, 
I wouldn't say in, it's unexpected. It's something that it's something that you wish it would have been announced or it w you you would have found out about this earlier. Like you were anticipating it. Yes, the, the full card. Ooh, I would say you're stalking this person. <laughs> this heaven of swords. <laughs> so there's a build up of energy coming from the external. Overseas coming email. It's called, it could also be a news. It's a major it's a major person. Because it, it's a, the center of the reading is the judgment card. It could also be like an approval of something. So you would get, it could also be from work, from bank, from a company. It could also be a person. Because this two of wands is looking at the ace of wands. So it's choosing your ace of wands. It's choosing to connect. It's choosing you. The funny thing is you've been stalking to this person. Or you've been like eagle eye checking it out online or you've been you've been on a daily regular basis awaiting for this hmm. four of cups um it is a slow progress okay so don't hurry love or don't hurry the situation because because i feel like you're very excited it's like you know like you jump right away even this one like you jump in an instant okay you won't lose the opportunity it came back for you the universe is telling you it's a slow progress it's slow but you'll get the offer also for some of you guys it could all like it could also be like a written in the stars because the judgment card finally it's here the reason why it's slow because there's some healing and you and this person is something that you would have to do a bit of a like you would have to take a little bit of risk for the situation and so they are to you with the seven of swords the full card that's why they're moving slow or they're processing it slow or moving slow but it's worth the wait like this is the major news that is worth the wait or person in here it's gonna it's moving slow towards you so don't hurt in love you just accept it process it and enjoy every moment because there's an there's a requirement to heal like this is a situation person you've got to heal in order for this judgment card to come into a solid one but I, it is a bit slow slow progress but it's exciting like you won't run like this is a person or a situation where while you wait for it to come into a big offer materialize or make it official you will never run out of being feeling excited gemini with the ace of wands okay and this is what i have for you guys thank you so much gemini for supporting the channel thank you so much guys for being here if you would like to further connect with me gemini please click the bell please click subscribe i will see you soon again guys you have a great day bye bye gemini